We're going to go ahead and run 3D Mark Fire Strike, see what kind of results we can get. As a reminder, this is the GTX 850M graphics card on there. You'll see our decimal meter set up off to the side, just to get you an idea of how much more noise is generated. Nothing real scientific-y about it, but, you know, it's just something that we throw in there a little bit extra for you. Um, as we're doing this, we'll go ahead and shoot our thermal pictures like we normally do, have those overlaid as the benchmark is running. And, of course, after it's done, we'll go over the, uh, over the scores. Fire strikes all finished up. We have our results in front of us here. You can see the score, 2883, and that's with the GeForce GTX 850M. You see our, get that out of the way, our graphics score, 3188, physics score, 8929, and combined score of 1056. We've got hardware monitor was running in the background here. You can see the temperatures on the CPU went anywhere from 82 Celsius. We got 83, 85, 89 up there as well. Um, hardware monitor was not picking up the GPU, so I went ahead and started MSI Afterburner. Uh, that was also running to see the GPU temps, and right up to 80 degrees uh, Celsius was the max temperature th that we saw there. So, a little high on the CPU side, very low on the GPU side. Uh, not the highest scores, but that's kind of expected with the GTX 850M, more of a mid-range video card. Uh, if you're looking for a real gaming power horse, you'll want the 870 or 880, um, you know, minimally the 860 out of there. So that's the results of 3D Mark Fire Strike. We went ahead and ran 3D Mark 11, taking a look at the results here. Our score, 4811. Showing the processor's not recognized here, and I think it showed that on the last one, too, but that's all right. It doesn't really affect the actual score, just the reporting. Graphics score, 4,719. Physics score, 6641, and a combined score of 3,798. So right on par where 3D Mark 11 is supposed to be on there. Let's check hardware monitor. Temperatures were about the same here, 82 to 88 is what we saw. Still not picking up the GPU here, so let's pull up the MSI Afterburner. And again, we were looking at a max of 80 degrees right there. Uh, so we're seeing uh, same temperatures right across the board uh, for 3D Mark 11 and 3D Mark Fire Strike. All right, got 3D Mark Vantage all ran. You see the score here, 16,176. GPU score, one, excuse me, 14,767. And the CPU score, 22,665. Let's check the temps, see if they were any different. You can see a little bit higher temps here for sure. 88 to 92, even a 93 thrown in there as well uh, for the CPU temps. So 3D Mark Vantage, which typically we do see the highest temps with Vantage. Uh, let's check out the GPU temps, a little bit lower, 79. So the other ones were hitting 80, so one degree Celsius lower uh, according to MSI Afterburner. So that'll kind of wrap up our look at the benchmarks.